Hey, what's up? This is Paul Murphy, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can connect your domains to Groove Pages and how you can actually set it up with an SSL certificate so that it's secure. So you get the little secure button at the top here. Um, so first of all, you need to have a purchase domain. Now you can obviously purchase that anywhere. I've used Namecheap, so I'll show you with Namecheap, but it's going to be pretty much the same sort of system. You just need to find out where you can change your name servers. So um, I'm going to, um, I've already connected this one down here. So I'm going to connect this one up the top here um, and I'm going to show you step by step. And then I'm going to show you how to set up a free SSL certificate using Cloudflare. So first of all, you go into manage and then you would put in, um, you would actually, it will say standard name service here. So um, actually I'm going to change that back to name cheap. So this will be. name cheap basic servers and then what we would need to do is go custom dns here and then what we're going to do is we're going to sign up with cloudflare okay so i've already done this for this one but i haven't done it for this new site so we're going to put in tube impact.com which is our new site we'll choose the free plan here And it will just sort of pull some data and then we just go continue. And then it's gonna say that this is the registrar and this is what it needs to be. So I'm going to go back to Namecheap. I'm gonna put this in here. And then I'm gonna go back to Namecheap and put this one in here in Name Server 2. And then I'm just gonna press the tick button. And that is done. And then what we'll do is we'll recheck name service. It takes a couple of minutes. So I'll just pause this. And that's done. So that literally took a minute, like 30 seconds or so. Um, you can, there's a button that says recheck name service, but if you just log out and log back in or go to another site, if you've got more than one site. Um, and then once that's done, we just need to do a couple of extra things. So we need to come over here and go to DNS. And then what we need to do is add a name server. So we're going to add a C name record. Okay, I use www. And then the target is um, here in Groove Pages. It's this thing here. So if you want to find this out, you come over to publish one of your pages. So when you've created a page, you that's when you would select your domain that you need for this website. So you come over to publish here. And then you'll see it says here to, to select this. So it's basically host10.groovepages.com. And then you would put that in your target. And then I set the DLL, DS, um, the TTL to automatic. It says proxy. So we just press save. Uh, actually, it's got a C name record. So we're going to get rid of that. We're going to delete it. And then we're going to press save because it's only going to be able to have one C name record with www. And that is it. That's pretty much done. Now, this will take a little bit of time. So in the meantime, if you're using your pages, you can obviously have yours hosted on their subdomain. Um, and I would leave it up to 24 hours just to make sure. Um, I actually added another domain yesterday and it's now added. So you can see this is added, but I hadn't done the SSL certificate. So at the moment, it's not showing as secure. Again, that takes up to 24 hours because an SSL certificate, even with Cloudflare, um, they kind of are applying it and it's, it does take 24 hours. Like it will do no matter what you do, even if you do it with your own name server. Now, there's one last thing that I want to do, and I'm going to copy this from another website, is add a page rule in here. Um, which basically means that it always loads over SSL. So this is the page rule here. I'm just going to kind of nick this and then change it to my website. So it's these little things here. So I'll go back to my uh, Tube Impact and then I'm going to basically come over to page rules again. Look, this one here. Then I'm going to press create a page rule and I'm going to put this in here, but I'm just going to change that to Tube Impact in here. And then I'm going to put always use SSL, okay, which means that it's going to force it onto SSL. Um, and that means, and also the other page rule that I like to do on here, if we go into DSS, DNS, um, 
That's not it. It's this one, I think. I want to put that on full. Okay, so when it's done, obviously, within 24 hours, once it's done, it means it's always going to load up as SSL. So if you're doing anything that's not secure, it's going to make sure that it's always secure, which is pretty good. And that will help with search engines because search engines love SSL certificates. Right, so it's 24 hours later, magically, and um, it actually is 24 hours later, and I've actually now got these. Um, this has all been configured and set up, so now we can actually load our websites over our SSL. And as you can see, that this is, these are Groove Pages. This is one of my websites with a padlock. This is another one with a padlock. And you can now navigate. I mean, obviously, that was a one I made, <laughs> crazy one I made. And then this one is this one I made in another demo. Um, and you can see that that's all now, rather than it being Groove Pages, it's now loaded over um, SSL. So that is how you would connect your domain and then get a free SSL from Cloudflare.